Hi everyone, it is me, Amanda, and I'm here to do my, uh, I think this is October's box for uh, Code Red Crate. Uh, for those of you not familiar with Code Red Crate, it is a monthly period subscription box uh, where they send you um, pads or tampons or uh, what your choice of feminine products, um, some snacks, some pampering items, just to kind of help um, uh, pamper you while you're on that time of the month. Um, and it's really kind of cool. So um, this service is I think fairly new um, within I think they started up I don't know for sure but I think it was just before summer at least that's when I started seeing videos popping up um, and they start out at good lord I want to say ten dollars a month and that's just for like snacks or um, teas or drinks or whatever and then you can get um, there's a yellow crate for twenty dollars there's an orange crate for twenty five dollars and then there's this one, um, $30, where you get your period supplies, your um, Advil, uh, pampering items, snacks, drinks, um, special gifts, you know, that kind of thing. Um, I think the orange box is just you know, like uh, period supplies and maybe a couple snacks. And then the orange box is, you know, like a step up. So there's different tiers. So, um and I, this is the second box that I've received from them. So I really love this service. The first box that I got, they sent, um, and I don't know if it's just for first time um, subscribers, and uh, but they sent you, uh, sent me a uh, cozy sock that you can place in the microwave and heat. And you can use for like, um, like if your back is really sore or if you've got really bad cramps, you can heat it up and, and use it to kind of heal, or not heal, but um, ease the, the tension in your muscles and um, help you soothe your muscles and helps you feel better. So I'm gonna open this up and see what we got. I did pre-cut the box, but I did not look inside because I fumbling around with sharp objects on camera is probably not the best thing for me. So um, get something like this and it just says, thank you so much for choosing code red crate to spoil you during your time of the month. And I don't know if you can really see them, but there are a couple of jack-o'-lanterns in there. So this must be October's box. And then on the other side, you have a list of all the things that are inside the box. The only thing I wish that they kind of would put in here is the, um, the retail value, but it's not a necessary thing. Um, that way you kind of know, uh, you know, if, if the cost of the box weighs out what's inside the box. Some people that might not be important, some people that might be, so I don't really know. Anyway, let's open it up. And it does look like this inside. There's some tissue paper on the top. And, oh, this is so cool. Little Halloween bags. So I'm going to start with this box, or bag here, believe. Yes, this is going to be your bag of tampons, pads. Um, I'm not going to open it and show you because I'm pretty sure you know everybody knows what tampons and pads look like. But um, you've got your tampons, pads, uh, some, uh, uh, there's, these ones aren't smelly, but, <laughs> or smelly goods, but you, uh, they're called masket baggies. You can put, you know, your tampons or pads in them and dispose of them easy. And then you've got a couple packages of Advil to help ease. Stuff. And you've got some um, Summer's Eve Simply Sensitive Cleansing Cloths to help um, clean, clean you and help you stay fresh. And then you've also got a ton of, looks like, tampons, panty liners, and pads. So, so there is that. And you get enough to, that it should last you your entire period. Um, unless for some reason you're having like an ultra heavy period, then you should probably go see a doctor. Um, just throwing that out there. So I will go to, oh my goodness, there's so many goodie bags in here. Where do I start? Oh, I'll save the snacks and stuff for last. I will go to, I'm thinking this is probably the goodie bag or uh, pampering bag. It comes in a cute Halloween themed bag. 
with no ribbon wrapped around it. Thank you, Lord. Um, it's hard enough to have to struggle with these little uh, wire tie things. Put this box to the side. There. So first thing I'm going to pull out here is a package of facial tissue. Three ply temper pack and they're super cute. They've got little pumpkins or jack-o'-lanterns on there and they're really fun colored. There's purple, hot pink, green, um, orange. So cute. Um, and then I have a business card. Botanical bars, natural handmade bath and body products. I don't know what that goes with. But I'll see if I can find out. Oh, it goes with this. Pumpkin Spice Body Lotion. Oh my god, really? I don't really smell the pumpkin spice in that. Oh, yeah, I do. I do now. Oh, that smells so amazing. And you get a pretty big container of it. I want to say that's probably about, what, eight ounces? No idea, it doesn't tell me. Oh, yep, it says eight on there, so I'm assuming that's eight ounce jar. It's kind of cool. Not kind of, that is. But if you're interested in some, you can go to www.botanicalbars.com or www.etsy.com forward slash shop forward slash botanical bars. And Use coupon code and you can receive ten thousand or ten thousand. Oh, you can see you can receive ten thousand dollars off. Holy cow! That's probably like the whole shop plus um. <laughs> wow, Amanda, uh, ten percent off. <laughs> Let's move along. Got a little tea light candle, which I think is supposed to be pumpkin, but I'm not really sure. Pumpkin pecan waffle sugar scrub cube. Oh my goodness. Mm. Pumpkin pecan waffle smell is so yummy by itself, but to have a sugar scrub cube, oh, amazing. And I've also got, I don't even think I'm going to open this. Although it does smell good. It says Witch's Brew Bath Salts. Scoop three tablespoons of mixture into the tub, which I won't be able to do because I do not have a bathtub. I have a shower. Do you feel bad for me yet? At any rate, um, and it does look like a lot of the salts came out, which is another reason why I'm not going to open this. But it does smell really good. In fact, I don't think, oh, no, there is a little, <laughs> there's a little bit of salt in the little cauldron. Um, I really wish I could take this out and show it to you, but I know it's going to make a huge mess. It's a, it's a um, witch's cauldron, and it is super adorable. But you can go to um, Nature's Whimsy Pure Body and Magic Skin Care. Um, let's see. Sorry, I'm trying to move some of the salt so I can read the business card. Um, there is a Facebook account, uh, Nature's Whimsy. So you go facebook.com forward slash Nature's Whimsy, you will find it. And that's W-I-M-S-E-Y. Oh, 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 and there was also a pocket back in Vampire Blood. Smell and see. I think it's a cherry, I think. I don't know. But I'm not going to put it on my hands because I have this wonderful, scrumptious smelling pumpkin spice lotion. Mm. Smells delicious. All right, moving on to some goodies. Oh, no, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna open this. Uh, Fight Like a Girl, Support Breast Cancer Awareness. 
I think this is super cool. This is a little um, cute goodie bag. Uh, it looks like there's a little bracelet, a really cute keychain with a boxing glove, uh, boxing glove that says fight with a little uh, heart on it. Um, looks like you got some chapstick and a ah, a pin with some angel wings and a heart. Because um, as we know, October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and so I think it's really cool that they included um, at least something small to kind of commemorate to that. Um, it's really, really cool. So thank you for that, guys. So now we will open up our Halloween goodies. I'm assuming that this is like something separate. Um, maybe not, but it's a separate little Ziploc baggie, which is really cute in itself, full of candy. So it's like, you know, because we're too old to go trick-or-treating, I don't know, maybe there's some adults out there that do go trick-or-treating, but I do not. So this is my trick-or-treat bag. Thanks! So we've got, I don't know if that's bubblegum or jawbreakers, but you got a couple of those. Um, a couple, uh, cichlets, uh, cichlets. Six, six bits. Ugh, I used to love those things when I was a kid. Um, not so much anymore. Some candy corn pops by Charms. Some actual candy corns. I will not be eating these. They are way too sweet. A Russell Stover caramel brownie. Lum. And some yep, 60 pieces of Russell Stover itty bitty pumpkins. And the itty bitty pumpkins that are on the package is says actual size. So I can believe that there's actually 60 of them in there. And they are pretty tiny. I wonder if I have a machine that actually counts 60. One of those actually 59. Or 56. Or 62. And a package of Raz Apple Magic Dip Fun Dip. Boom. Mind blown. I don't know why I said that. I think I just kind of wanted to. Oh! My battery is flashing because I'm special. I will be back. One moment. Hey everybody, I'm back. Sorry, I had to change batteries, although this one doesn't look like it's gonna last very long either. Just my luck. That's awesome. So I will try to speed through this. Um, also in that baggie, I had a Reese's peanut butter cup. So yummy. Now, move on to the little drink packet here, and then I will go to my large food basket. Um, ah, open, open sesame. So I've got a couple packages of apple cider. It looks like one in caramel and one in original. Shut up, caramel. Oh my gosh, okay. Awesome. And it looks like I've got some stashed tea, um, apple, or maple apple cider, uh, cinnamon vanilla. I actually had this the other day, um, wasn't that great. Um, it's kind of weird. And then Twinnings Chai Pumpkin Spice Tea. Oh my god, yum. Can't wait to have this. And moving on. Maybe not. Because my battery light's flashing. I'll be back. Maybe. Okay, now that I found a battery that is actually full, maybe I can continue my review. Sorry about that, guys. Um, rather embarrassing. But anyway, um, didn't miss much. I was just moving on to the bigger bag of food. And we'll go from there. I see some sun-made vanilla yogurt-covered raisins. How cool is that? I didn't even know they made these in the little tiny boxes. So yummy. And a single package of Nutella. Yum. My husband, excuse me, my husband will dig that. Little Bites. Pumpkin muffins made with real pumpkin. Oh, so cool. I can't wait to eat those. Mm. Oh, my, I'm going to see the whole thing. Gluten-free Oots Halloween mini 
white cheddar cheese balls. I wonder if they're little, I supposed to be like little eyeballs. Kind of cute. I say everything's kind of cute. Well, mostly everything's kind of cute. But, you know, because sometimes a lot of things are really kind of cute. Pirate's Booty Aged White Cheddar. Now, this stuff is, like, super awesome. If you haven't tried it, you should go to your grocery store. I think, like, Fred Meyer or um, Safeway probably carries them. I know Costco does in the, like, big, huge, giant bags if you can eat that much, which I probably could, but it's probably not very good for you. In large proportions like that. Um, but this is uh, baked rice and corn puffs, no artificial colors, flavors, or preserv preservatives, gluten-free, zero grams trans fat per serving trick our treat uh, anyway just basically what I'm trying to say is those are really good so, uh, Chex Mix Muddy Buddy Peanut Butter and Chocolate oh, I love this I love the snacks they put in here Garden Veggie Chips Ghosts and Bats those are freaking adorable and these are also really good um really good. Um, Halloween fruit flavored fruit snacks by Betty Crocker. Love me some fruit snacks. You can never go wrong with fruit snacks. And last but not least, we have some Archer Farms Monster Trail Mix. You've got some with nuts, candies, and raisins. Looks like uh, chocolate and chocolate chips, peanut butter chips, and the NEM type candies. Uh, raisins, peanuts, Yummy goodness and protein and uh, sweet and salty all in one bag. So uh, that is it for this month's um, Code Red Crate. If you're interested, go to www.coderate.com, codecraterede.com, my gosh, um, and do all the necessary stuff such as filling out your name, address, um, what period supplies you want, and which box you want, and go from there. Uh, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up, uh, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.